Hey, I'm Brandon, joined here by my buddy Pat. Today we are checking out the Asterix Ultra Cell 4.0 knee braces, coming in at $750. Now, if you're not familiar with knee braces, this is something geared towards dirt riders out there, and they provide you an extra level of protection, specifically associated with torsional and lateral protection, but you do also get some impact protection right there at the knee as well. Now, the Ultra Cell 4.0, this is an updated version from the 3.0. It's a bit more low profile. The patella changed a little bit. It's a bit more slimmer in its overall design because most of the dirt jerseys and pants are trending a bit more on the slim side of the spectrum. So with this new design, it should fit under there a bit more easily and a bit more comfortably with the rest of your gear. But as I mentioned, coming in at 750 bucks, so of course it's going to ship to you for free. We do have our price match policy in place that is there to ensure that you're getting the best deal around. So make sure that you're taking advantage of that. Now the main construction here, we've got a carbon fiber and TPU main construction, so it's very sturdy but it's lightweight. And speaking of carbon fiber and lightweight, if you want to step it up, you could check out their uh, carbon cell. That's going to be a, an option within their line that is a step up. It's a full carbon construction. And again, it's a bit more lightweight in comparison, but you're going to pay a bit more uh, for that. This one's around 750 bucks. As I mentioned before, I think that one's around the 820, 850 range. Don't quote me on that one, but you could step it up if you're looking for a more lightweight option. And again, that's the carbon cell version. So as I mentioned before, the main benefit to these for the dirt rider out there is the torsional and lateral protection, right? I'm gonna grab this. It's got a kind of a ball and socket design here on the inside of it, but it's got a little bit of movement, which is a little bit tough to articulate as you're wearing them, but it gives you a little bit of movement here, but it's got this strong backbone, this strong structure surrounding the leg and the knee to support it. So if you're throwing a leg out there, uh, you know, at the track, or maybe you're hitting the trails or something like that. If you're throwing a leg out there, something grabs and twists your foot, um, you know, it is gonna give you that backbone and that structure to help support you and protect you uh, in that instance. Personally, I love knee braces. I cannot ride in the dirt without them now. Some people don't love them. They find them cumbersome and heavy um, and a bit more on the pricey side of the spectrum. But talking to a guy who's broken his leg and his ankle and torn ligaments, and I've got plates and stuff in my leg now from dirt biking, um, I, I strongly recommend the knee braces. I think it's very much worth the investment. It's far cheaper than hospital bills and being out of riding for months at a time. So that's my little spiel there. We'll keep it moving. Lots of adjustability with these knee braces. Pat, can you go ahead and swing to the other side so we can kind of get a, a quick look here at the side of this and just kind of that backbone there. And as you can see, there's little Allen keys and little pockets of adjustability all throughout this knee brace. So you can fine tune it to fit your needs and your build. We all come in different shapes and sizes, right? So it's very easy to adjust this and fine tune, you know, how close it is on the knee. You've got foam padding on the inside. These are incredibly, incredibly comfortable knee braces. Certainly want to drive that home. Plenty of adjustability via Velcro right here on the sides as well. And again, with that foam backing, it's a really nice structure that it, and it's gonna last quite a long time and you can fine tune this very, very easily. And as you can see this little red, pieces on the inside right here on the side. You can see that little Allen key. Again, that's going to allow you to adjust it, pull it in, pull it out. So if you need it a little bit more snug against your leg and then you can tension it down with the Velcro straps here, it's very easy, very simple to do. They do include the, uh, the Allen tool to allow you to easily do that. Pat, go ahead and bend. Let's kind of see how that movement here, yeah. <clears throat> As you can see, it's not restricting your movement up and down, but it is also gonna help, if Pat straightens out, it is gonna help with that forward motion right there. It's only gonna allow you to go so far, it's gonna help prevent hyperextension, and that is also adjustable, which is really nice as well. Pat, go ahead and face the back for me real quick. Get a quick look here at this strap system, as you can see the four straps here. And on this one leg right here, Pat actually has the sleeves. These sleeves are included, and that's just gonna add some additional comfort. You can see he's wearing it underneath. It's gonna add some additional comfort for you if you wanna wear some shorts, you don't wanna wear long base layers. You can wear that sleeve. I wear the sleeve over base layers sometimes too because having this bottom piece up over it actually just helps it stay in place a little bit better than if you were to ride in these without that sleeve. So I like that uh, they include those. I highly recommend wearing them. They're gonna make it uh, a bit more comfortable, and again, just add a little bit more 
stability and keep, keep everything in place as you're riding. Pat, go ahead and face the front for me, sir. <clears throat> now, they updated the patella, as I mentioned before. This uh, is the protection here. It floats around a little bit, it, it moves a little bit, but it's still gonna give you some nice impact protection here. Technically, it is CE level one protection for impact in this particular, uh, particular area right there, but it does have a little bit of movement, so it's not gonna feel restrictive if you're moving around on the bike and you wanna hug the bike, well, this will kind of slot out of the way, so it's you know not just stout and stuck in that particular location. I've uh, used some other knee braces where this doesn't float around, and I personally kind of like that. And you can actually pop this off if you wanted to do so, and you don't want that knee protection. It's very easy to remove as well. Now, as we swing down to the bottom of these knee braces, one other thing I wanted to point out is you might see this little buckle system right here towards the bottom of the knee brace. This is actually designed to link up to your boot. It actually helps this stay in place and kind of stays aligned with the structure of your leg and knee and keeping everything protected, of course. Um, but you will have to drill a hole in your boot. You're going to have to cut a hole in your pants. Asterisk actually does have a detailed breakdown video on that and just giving you kind of step-by-step -step instructions if that's something you want to add. Most riders I know don't actually use this, but I like that they're giving you that attention uh, to the detail and just that extra level of protection if you want it. Uh, it's certainly something you could incorporate. And they give you the other strap, right, that goes to your, to your boots and it locks in here and just, just give me that additional structure and stability here, keeping everything in alignment and in place. But if it's not something you wanna use, just snip that right out of place. You don't have to worry about it, not a big deal. But overall, I really like these knee braces. I like what Asterix done. They've not stepped away from their original design too much, but they've made some, some nice updates a little bit more low profile, very comfortable, certainly something that's gonna give you that extra level of protection that I personally feel is absolutely worth the investment. Trust me, hospital bills get pretty expensive. So uh, if you have any additional questions, click that info button, that'll take you over to the product page where you can take a closer look at these in detail. And of course, if you have any additional questions for us, do not hesitate, reach out to our CS team. They're all riders, all more than happy to get you pointing in the right direction. Thanks for hanging out with Pat and I and taking a closer look at the Asterix Ultra Cell 4.0 knee braces. I'm Brandon, keep it pinned.